K-State football players have not been shy. Their goal this year, the Big 12 title, but after the loss to the Longhorns, it's going to be an uphill climb. The Wildcats would have to win all of their final three games and get two losses in those final three weeks from both Oklahoma State and Texas. You don't need me to tell you it looks unlikely. So my question today, is there still motivation in that locker room? Texas is one of the best teams in the country, and we get beat on the last play of the game. Our program's in pretty good shape right now. We're going to be okay, and we're going to keep battling because we have the right guys in the locker room that believe in what we're doing, and it's fun to be around those guys, and we have a blast. And it's fun to be around these guys because they are competitors. You never know what's going to happen, um, and even if there's that little shadow of a, of a chance that, that we might have a, have a chance, we're going to keep fighting. We're worried about creating our legacy and, and controlling what we can for the next three weeks and, and enjoying it. You can look at that game the other day, um, the guys and how they responded. I think many teams probably would have thrown in the towel. And that says everything you need to know about the fight in the guys and how much they care and want to win. The best news for this weekend for Kansas State fans is not who they play, but where they play. The Cats are back here in Bill Snyder Family Stadium where they're not only a perfect 5-0 and on the year, They've outscored opponents a combined 213 to 47. K-State gets Baylor this Saturday. Working for you in Manhattan, Glenn Kinley, 27 Sports.